Hey, what's up, everybody? It's your boy Home P, the comfortable gamer slouch here, the CGS. Here with his first edition for gaming news and gaming deals. That's right, this is my first screen capture gaming news. So let's get started with what I got going on today. Let's go over here really quick. First off, if you love Twitter, follow me on Twitter. My name is at Home P, the same name as my YouTube channel. On here, I display my rants, rage, crazy tweets, and likes and comments. You can check it out. So follow me to follow me around. Do what you want to do. It's your boy, Home P. Let's get this stuff started. First off, let's go to my profile page here and try to find some gaming news for you guys. Um, let me see. So how you guys doing today on this lovely Friday evening? I am, look at that, it says playing uh, Devil May Cry HD, still playing that, gotta finish up that video. These are one of the good followers that I have that's following me right now, and they have great gaming deals almost daily or every half an hour. Currently, if you don't have a uh, Batman for the PC, and if you're a PC gamer, you can now get Batman Arkham City for $15 at GameFly, digital download, $15 right now. Go to GameFly. You can buy for them. I don't know if you can have to be a member or not, but um, it's a good deal. I, I know I saw somewhere much, much cheaper than that. Maybe for like five, five dollars, I guess. And I know the gaming news. You can oh, the page I found. Oh lord. <laughs> All right, let's just get out of there with that one. Also, for you Splinter Cell fans, if you haven't gotten the HD collection, you can get the HD collection. For $16 free shipping with newegg.com. Head over to newegg.com right now to get that deal for you guys. All right, all right. Some other news for the PlayStation Network, my PSN, my PlayStation Network people, the plus subscribers. You got some good stuff for you. Let's go kick it, kick it right now. Uh, let's go to the PlayStation Store update. Let's see what we got over here. All right, so in PlayStation Store update for my plus subscribers, go ahead and download that I'm Alive demo. I'll be doing that as well. I haven't done it so. So this is how I'm talking about this. I have not done it. For your free games available, you got Shank 2. You can get Shank 2. If you haven't played Shank 1, go get it. I don't know how much it is, but Shank 2 is free if you're a PlayStation Plus uh, subscriber. Um, for those who are talking about the Silent Hill HD collection that hasn't should have had part one Even though it has some issues because I myself have not played it yet I will not play it until all the issues are been addressed You can get Silent Hill Classic Edition PlayStation 1 in its entirety the way it is no HD no remake. Sorry guys Konami wasn't having that but it's free you can go get it so you can enjoy the trilogy as well Shift 2 Unleash. I had this game I didn't really like it too much, but if it's free, then I'm just gonna get it, you know. Uh, you got free avatars from Escape Plan, you got discounts on like Mortal Kombat, you know, Devil May Cry avatar bundles, all of them for 99 cents, and stuff like that. And of course, like I was telling you earlier, game demos, and you can either buy I'm Alive for $15 or just play the demo. I say, play the demo. All right, let's go into some other news here. What do I got? Uh, let me have you check out my Amazon wish list. What I have on Amazon, what I'm looking at to get lately. Let's do it real quick. Let's go. All right, so what do I got here? A couple of things I've been watching for a while. Yeah, no, I didn't. <clears throat> I didn't know I had the Mario Kart 7. I didn't know it was out at the time when I was playing in the GameStop. Uh, and, you know, I wasn't. I didn't want to pay $40 for it, you know, I wanted to wait till the price drop. I do love the game, I played that GameStop for a while, but, you know, I've been watching it, only dropped $5 so far, so maybe it'll drop to like $29, we'll see. I don't know yet, but let's just go scour down to see what else I got. Xbox 360 fight pad, I want to get that, PS3 fight stick, uh, some stuff I'm not really interested in. Um, ooh, Kingdoms of Amalur, I should buy that later on today. This one had a price drop. Uh, it says here it was $44 when it was added. Now it's $39. If you haven't gotten this game, go get it. I haven't played the game yet, but I've been hearing all the great things about it. So go get that game. I'm gonna try to get it. You know, thanks to Miss Karen, she was playing some gameplay for me. She told me it was very, very good. And I respect her opinion, so I'm gonna 
get this game and also looking into getting this game darkness 2 it's currently at 47 dollars it's not enough for me to want to get it so i can probably get it used where it says here for uh 27 bucks or something like that i don't know the condition of it but you know i see the prices here so let's go into some gaming news and gaming deals gaming deals are gone gaming news we have for you so far the Mass Effect 3 Resurgence DLC pack is coming next week for you guys. This is the multiplayer pack. This is not the current in the works ending that Bioware is currently uh, heading into. But I'm going to play the trailer for you just for a little bit. If the volume gets slow, if there's any static noise or anything like that, I apologize for that. So please bear with me. So that was Mass Effect 3 Resurgence Pack coming next week to you guys. They don't want to give you too much, so head on over to GameTrailers.com and get the full trailer. Next up, we got a game called Deadlight. Yes, this is a puzzle game for the Xbox 360 Arcade. It's a puzzle platformer made exclusively only to the Xbox, developed by Tequila Works. And here's a trailer for you guys. Speed us up. Oh, it looks like a shooter. It looks like Modern Warfare 3 to me. The remains from a battle between men and shadows. Alright, so you guys, when you guys get a chance, go check out that Deadlight on YouTube where you get all your free trailers. Next up, we're gonna go check out what Nintendo and Sega's been up to. Apparently, the guy Hiro Kazooie Yashara is going to join Nintendo as their software technology lead or whatever it's going to be called. But yeah, an old guy that been with Sega since 1988 is going to breathe life into Nintendo somehow. So we'll see how that is going to work out. So big ups to him for Nintendo for the listing this guy from Sonic, the co creator of Sonic. We hope things work out very well and they bring fresh new content to the biz. Next up, we up for the controversial same-sex gay content in gaming. And EA is standing up to the critics for that. And they have no intention of removing that same-sex relationship options from his games. Because it's a free speech, they say. But I'm not going to play any trailers here. I'm just letting you know right now that's what they're going through and people are complaining about it. You know... It's, it is what it is. So, moving on, moving on. For those of you who haven't been keeping up with Spec Ops The Line, remember when it got announced how many years ago? Then they went off the map, and then all of a sudden now they're back in the business. Go check out the new Spec Ops The Line uh, Welcomes to Hell trailer that Activision had sent over to me. Well, not to me, but just trying to add it there like I'm somebody else. So, check that out if you haven't, and go pre order that game. Drops uh, sometime this June. All right, all right. Prototype comes out in three weeks, and they got the Tank Mayhem trailer. That's right. Heller versus Mercer, I believe. What is this? Get this out of the way. Heller versus Mercer, I believe. This prototype two. Well, look at this now. Oh, sorry. If you're getting the prototype two on PC, it has been delayed until July 24th. That's an extra two months from the release date for the consoles. So if you guys are getting upset about that, I feel sorry for you. Get that game on consoles. Last but not least, Sniper Elite V2 demo has a release date, has been confirmed. It will come out next week on Xbox Live and PlayStation Network. I have pre-ordered this game and I am excited to see what this game is about. Well, actually, here's a trailer right here. I can play it a little bit for you. I don't think I have much time. Nice Why do they always send these sponsor messages? Anyways, check it out on YouTube, Sniper Elite. Uh, the demo will be, be dropping soon and um, I think that's it for the news today so I'm going to close out with giving a shout out to my boy Viewmaster617 the arcade main gamer go check him out real real decent dude I'm telling you go show your support if you're a main gamer PC gamer he's into games next up my man will kill a bitch I swear I think this dude is from the south but his commentaries be having me dying will kill a bitch is the man man I'm telling you 
219 Gary and Miss Karen. What's going on, girl? You do your thing. Keep doing what you do. Love your vids. Keep being yourself. And keep your head up as usual. And keep me uplifted as well. Another one is straight up reviews. What's up, man? I saw you this video to all them haters that be coming on you. Don't let them get to you. I know you're not letting them get to you, dog. I know. I know you're just showing them who you make it, they're making you stronger. But these guys do it because they know they're going to get a response. And that's what they want. But big ups to you straight up. Keep doing your thing no matter what. But the hell with all these haters, man. And last but not least, that nigga, that mother freaking nigga, that mother. Let me stop. Super Brother 779, the most ignorant drone buster best of both worlds dude ever. If he hearing this, you better give me a shout out, son. And last but not least, of course, Warzone Gaming HD, Supreme TV. That's my man right there. That's my dog. Check out his videos. He does great boxings, good gameplays, and commentary. And this is your boy, Home P, the comfortable gamer slouch, coming to you and signing out. I hope I didn't bore you. Yeah.